hey youtube welcome back to my channel i am zaria and i am back with another video and today we are dyeing our hair for the first time y'all i have virgin hair okay I have never dyed my hair. I have never permed my hair. I never put any chemicals in my hair. Besides me having heat damage, like way back when, that was it. That was the most damage I have ever done to my hair. So, we are finally dyeing our hair. Y'all, I've been thinking about this for so long. So long. My mama don't like the idea, but I just... I don't care. Like, I can't do it no more. I've been having the urge to dye my hair for so long, and now I'm doing it. Before we get started into this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and tap that bell to be notified when I upload. And everything will be in the description box below. Also, follow all of our socials, which is also in the description box below. And y'all, if I sound a little stuffy, it's because I am. I don't know what it is, but it's something in the hair products when I wash my hair. It, I don't know, I guess I'm allergic to something in the hair products and it, it makes me sneeze and just clog up all of my nose. So, I don't know what it is. Anyways, um, the color I am doing will be Honey Blonde. And I have four boxes of these. I'm just going to show you everything I got. I have four boxes of these and I have the 30 developer and a small thing a 20 developer i got the 30 developer for my hair hair and i got 20 for my roots because i am virgin headed i didn't need to get 30 for the hair hair i think that's what she's supposed to do anyways but i heard somebody get 20 on their roots because so it won't be so strong and i thought that was a good idea so i was just like okay well, i'm gonna do that too so hopefully it takes my roots take as much as my hair but yeah so i also read the box or whatever and all the instructions you know, what the heck all the instructions because i don't got time for that like i really don't so yeah oh they got some stuff in here too i want to open it up because y'all, I'm, I'm not gonna be bald headed. Like, I need to know everything before I put this stuff in my hair. Now, I didn't watch so many videos on this, so I should be good, but I'm just making sure, you know. And they have some stuff in this, and a whole bunch of stuff. I think we should just go ahead and get started. I um have this little thing, this little applicator brush. And I've been having this for my wigs and stuff. And I thought I had the little applicator um, bowl, but I don't. So I just had to use some plastic bowls, some old plastic bowls. And that I don't mind getting messed up because they are really old. And we don't really use them. So, yeah. Okay, and I got me some gloves and all of that. And I think I'm ready to go pretty much. I think I'm just like kind of like, you know contemplating on if I should really do this but we just go ahead and get started because yeah I washed my hair two days ago because I, I know it says some of them said like do it on you know dirty hair but my hair was too dirty y'all so I just went ahead and washed it and so that it won't like you know not take or do its job so I washed my hair and I blow dried it. I did wear it up in a ponytail yesterday. So I do have a little of the um, edge control on my edges. And now I'm gonna start with this section, I think, the back section. And I'm just gonna go ahead and mix my stuff in the bowl. It said to mix 2.5 ounces into this um, dye. <laughs> But uh, I don't have a measuring cup or anything, so I don't know how. Ouch! I don't know how I would do that. So I'm gonna just mix as I go. This stuff smells exactly like bleach. <laughs> I'm so scared. Oh my god! By the way, y'all, I will not be bleaching my hair. 
because that's not the healthy way to do it. We're not finna bleach our hair. And I refuse, I refuse to damage my hair, you know, with some bleach. So we're just gonna do this the healthy way. I'm also gonna mix the um, 20 developer with the box too because I don't wanna take too long mixing the 20 developer while the 30 developer is sitting on my hair. And then, yeah, yeah we're not gonna do that. And I'm guessing you mix this until it's like a creamy consistency. I left it like this. This type of consistency is, it looks okay to me. So it's not too like loose and it's not too thick. So that's what I'm gonna leave it at. Now I'm gonna go ahead and mix the one with the 20 developer. Okay y'all, so now we finna get started. So I'm just gonna split this into a smaller section. About right there. I'm gonna comb this out. And y'all, you wanna, um, don't start at your roots. So I'm using the 30 developer right now. And I'm just gonna, I guess, start from right here. It's set about an inch away from your roots. Oh my God, I'm really doing this. Can y'all see? You wanna just distribute it as much as you can. Okay. Now we're gonna move on to the next section, I guess. Okay, well, so this is one section and I think I'm gonna like put a clip on it I don't know. Just to like get it on my way, I guess.
had ran out of these clips, so I had to just use this. Couldn't find it. <coughs> but y'all, y'all know the series. I can barely swallow. Now I'm gonna start on my um, roots. And I'm just gonna start at the first one that I did. So, um, this one is taking the dye of the bowl, and I'm I'm hoping that it's not gonna be red in my head. So I don't know what I should do. Like, I didn't know that it was gonna be that. So let's just hope for the best. I'm kind of used. Uh, scared to use this one the other one is fine but this one is like literally turning red plastic bag on my head you know, so that you know I could trap the heat and stuff like that I wish I had some ram wrap but I don't so I'm just gonna use a plastic bag okay y'all uh, and so I'm just gonna let this sit for like 20 minutes and I'm just gonna come back and take this off and rinse it out my head and I'm gonna come back to y'all so I just let this sit I actually let it sit for like 30 minutes because I felt like it wasn't heating up like it was supposed to like people were saying so I let it sit for like about 30 minutes. And now I'm about to get in the shower and rinse this out and wash my hair. So I am about to take this off. I'm so scared. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo. Look at it. I am so in shock. It's actually kind of pretty. I wish my roots was a little darker now. Okay, I lied. I'm going to rinse my hair out in the tub, but I'm not going to actually put my whole body in the tub. So yeah, that's how I'm going to do it. Um, I'm going to see if I can set y'all up so that y'all can see.
okay y'all so i was just playing around with this stuff but um i'm pretty much done i washed my hair and everything i deep conditioned i deep conditioned with this um, that's what i used to deep condition with because i read that this was good for colored hair and it it is good now i'm not saying for colored hair because i don't know yet i got this was my first time using it but it has a lot of slip and it's like it looks like so moisturizing so i think i will hold on to this so i style my hair i'm gonna come back on here and i'm gonna show you guys the outcome of how everything looks but so far this is how it looks and i really like it i'm really satisfied with my my results so yeah I'm gonna come back to y'all when I style my hair. Okay, you guys, so it is three days um, after I dyed my hair. I meant to come on here like yesterday and earlier when I got home from school, but I forgot. But this is how my hair is looking. I don't know if y'all can see. I think it's a little dark. But yeah, this is how my hair is looking and I did this little style or whatever. You know, just trying stuff out with my new hair color because, yeah. But I'm definitely taking this style out, like, this weekend because it's, it has too much tension on my edges and I don't like that. So, yeah. But this is how the color came out. I am really satisfied with the results. Like, y'all, it came out exactly how I wanted it. At first, I thought my hair wasn't going to take it, but it did. It's so much better this morning. But, you know, I forgot to come on here and show y'all that. So that's my fault, and I'm sorry. But and I'm gonna just turn around, give y'all 360. By the way, in the back, it is kind of like messed up because I put it in a puff earlier when I got home. So, but I'm gonna just give y'all 360 and show y'all the color like more close up and personal, just so y'all can see, get into the details, you know. But yeah, so this is the front or whatever, and this side is actually lighter then this side but you can barely tell and that's because you know i was running out of um 20 developer the hair dye that was mixed with the 20 developer and i only bought four boxes of dye so i was running out so i just had to mix i kind of mixed it together 20 and 30. didn't really mix it but i was running out of 20 on this side so i just had to finish with her type stuff so that's why this side came out a little lighter, but you can barely tell. I think it's this side. I think it was this side. I don't know whichever side, but yeah. I think that's really it like i don't know i like a lion right now <laughs> but yeah um by the way my hair didn't experience any damage that i noticed or anything like that so basically just everything y'all need to know uh, nothing my hair has not really changed except for the color and everything that was meant to change so yeah just let y'all know and i have to stay on top of my hair care routine because y'all know color treated hair color treated hair is supposed to be treated like more consistent and better than it's supposed to be treated with your natural hair color like yeah you're supposed to treat your hair the same but still you have to take it a little further the little the steps a little further especially if you dye your hair light you gotta take it a little further you can't be messing up your hair like that sis so if you want healthy colored hair, I just say deep condition a lot. Um, detangle properly. Like don't be doing the most. Don't be doing the most. But yeah, that is it on this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And tap that bell to be notified when I upload. And yeah, I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye guys. Do you even feel me? No, you don't. I know. You don't, I know, impatient, conceited, but I swear it's like I need